2011 Open champion and 2016 European Ryder Cup team captain Darren Clark took a break from golfing and fishing to give us a playing tip on how to hit in the wind. Hi, it's Darren Clark here again at uh, the beautiful Abba Coat Club here in Winding Bay in the Bahamas. I'm here in the 17th hole, little par three, signature par three here. Gets a little bit breezy here in the Bahamas, uh, for those of you that have been here before, for those of you that haven't, it's, it's known for getting a little bit windy and stuff. So when we come and play here, one of the shots that you really need to be able to do is a little bit of a knockdown shot. Uh, you know, I grew up in Ireland playing at home where it gets very windy and, and something that we grew up doing, but I play in lots of pro-ams and, and see lots of guys that are a little bit uncomfortable with it. So I'll just try and run you through a little bit this, this shot here. I got 162, 63 yards down to the flag there. Probably playing about 156, breeze into off the right. Um, so I'd probably try and hit a little just chippy knockdown seven iron there. So first part of it is that I'd always just go down a little bit down the shaft. Um, that would give me a little bit more control of the club head and uh, in doing so help me keep the ball down a little bit lower. Uh, secondly, we determine the trajectory of the ball by how far forward or back it is in our stance. So if you want the ball higher, it's more forward in your stance. If you want it lower, it's further towards your right foot back in your stance for a right-handed golfer. So the third thing, is when people tend to play in the, in the wind, they, they tend to swing harder, firmer, faster, and that doesn't work. So if anything, in the wind, it's got to be a little bit smoother. I'm down the shaft, ball is a little bit more back towards my right hand, my right foot, being right-handed, smooth little swing. That's good. <laughs> As you can see there, the other little bit that I forgot to put in was that my, my finish is very short, so I'm trying to control the club head. So it's never a full swing in the wind, it's always probably a little bit of a shorter, more compact swing. So hopefully you'll be able to use that, and uh, I'll see you the next time you're down here in the Abaco Club here in Winding Bay in the Bahamas.